Next slide, shall we? All right. uh, Thanks, welcome everybody to the 2021 Spring Bloom. That's virtual. So uh, we're, we're, Juan's going to lead most of the program today. I'm just going to jump in right here and say, remember, always be a rewards member and you can get a point. And where you sign up, you sign up at Garden Style san antonio or sa.com and become a rewards member uh you will fill in the survey afterwards and you can sign, find that survey at garden style san antonio forward slash spring hyphen bloom and we'll have that available and you fill that out and you will be able to get a point just to remind everybody we are having two webinars a day today Thursday, Friday, and on Saturday, we're having three. However, you may receive one point and only one point per day. So uh, we encourage you to go to every webinar, of course, but there's only going to be one point per day. And again, rewards member, and you have to fill out the survey. As Martha said, all questions should go in Q&A, not the chat. Uh, Anything else, Juan, before you take off? Uh, no, I just want to make sure Martha didn't have anything else to add before we get started. Uh, the only thing is the, the Q&A you can see here on the screen, there's three dots at the bottom. Sometimes you have to click that to get to the Q&A. Um, and so just check that. Yes, uh, our coworker Sasha created a really great slide on this, and you can see those three little dots. She has a Q and A down at the bottom, right next to the caterpillar. So, uh, without further ado, all right. Well, actually, Mark, this one you. I am. I, I just wanted you to to, to move. Uh, right. Thank you, uh, ladies and gentlemen. We have lots of opportunities here at South South Conservation, and one of them for getting information is, uh, or I should say two of them, is our uh, um, our reports. First one is, have you signed up? Have you signed up for the garden style e-newsletter? E-newsletter comes out every Tuesday in the afternoon and it is chock full of information, uh, information about programs, plants, and how to do the maintenance on your lawn and landscape. Uh, the other, is a water smart report now the water smart report comes out monthly and it's also an e-newsletter and it will have several different types of messages uh directing you to conservation water conservation practices and programs it will also try to encourage you to go into the water smart library and that has over 70 72 different articles and messages on how to do water conservation. So I highly encourage you to go and sign up. Well, the Water Smart will be uh, directed to you or you can sign up for that. And Martha, where can they sign up for that, for the Water Smart? Do we still have an opening? Is it on, on saws.org? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so go to the homepage and put in water smart newsletter and you'll be able to sign up for that so i highly encourage everybody to do that uh also just let everyone know the newsletter the garden style newsletter all the articles in that are archived and you can see that again at garden style all right so well take it away all right Wait so, a minute. Do I have the next slide too? No, I do. Okay. Right. Started. Thank you, Mark. And I uh, welcome everyone to Spring Bloom 2021. Not the way we would have liked it, but this is what we have. And we have a lot of great information over the next few days. So as Mark said, we have a lot of information that comes that you can sign up and will come to your inbox. But you will always have GarnStyleSA.com as a resource as well. Um, uh, what I've done here, what you see before you, is I've highlighted 
the water saver programs. The drop menu there is the list of all the programs that we have available for our customers. Uh, this, this list includes residential, which we'll be talking about today, and some commercial programs as well. Uh, before I get started on the individual programs that we'll be focused on today, I do want to mention a couple of things. As you can see in the main menu at the top bar there, uh, this is a, a, a picture of our website. You see other great things in our website, such as gardening resources. It's a great, there's a wealth of information there if you're a beginner gardener or just need more information on maintenance, things like that. Uh, videos and galleries, great resource. We have a lot of how to do videos. So you may want to check that out. There's a lot there on watering, pruning, things of that nature. Uh, and then of course, as Mark said, the garden articles that are archived, uh, there you will find, you just simply put in a topic in the search and you will, it'll bring up all kinds of articles. Okay, now, like I said, we're gonna be focused on our residential programs today. And um, so that we don't leave out any, I'm gonna mention one before we move on. For those customers that ha do have a swimming pool, uh, we do have a replace your sand or DE filter. You can replace that with a high efficiency cartridge that will help you save water and energy. With that being said, we will cover every program that residents may, may be interested in today. Okay, so let's get started. All right, so the bulk of what we'll be focusing today will be on these four programs in addition to others, okay? So from left to right, we have landscape coupon, the patioscape coupon, irrigation design rebate for those with irrigation and our rewards program. So the landscape coupon and the patioscape coupon kind of go together. You can choose to do uh, all landscape or all patioscape or a combination of landscape and patioscape. In the lifetime of this program, you can only get eight in any combination, but it, it encourages you to do up to 1,600 square feet of transformation in your yard. The landscape coupon, for example, is uh, for every 200 square feet of grass that you remove, you're sent a coupon for $100 to purchase the plants that you would use to create your new landscape bed. The patio scape is also $100 for those without irrigation. Um, same idea, 200 square feet of grass removal. And uh, for those with irrigation, the coupon is actually $200. We'll go into a little bit more on that about that uh, later. And for those that have an irrigation system, uh, since irrigation is not allowed in the landscape and patio scape area where you're transforming, uh, depending on how much change you make, you could qualify for an irrigation rebate. So we'll touch on that as well. That can range anywhere from hundreds to possibly thousands of dollars. And then the one program that really just enhances everything, in my opinion, is the rewards program. That program, you can earn up to $150 in, in coupons per year. So with that in mind, let's get started. Oops. All right. <laughs> so before you, you see uh, a picture that was actually submitted by our customer. When the customer first applied, submitted the picture on the left as the intention as to what he what this customer intended to do. He had identified the area he was going to transform. On I mean on the right, you see what the customer actually did. It's very, very impressive. This particular customer did up to 800 square feet of grass removal and transformation. Um, that amounts to about 60 plants. So that was four hundred dollars that went towards this project. Very, very impressive indeed. Um, let's see here, make sure I cover everything. All right. So one of the things that I also wanna make you aware of is that the average cost per coupon um, for all the plans has been about $125. Of course, that amount can differ because we don't dictate the price at the vendors. So depending on the plans that you pick, you, that'll dictate the total uh, cost of the, of the plants you choose. But on average, it's about $125. So $125 minus $100 from the coupon, that's $25 out of pocket to you. A great deal, a great, great deal. So in the case that we see before you, that would have been, let's say $400, uh, $500 with our coupons minus 400. A great help indeed. Okay, the other, just to show you what else you can do, 
is that you don't have to do 800. You can do it in increments of 200, 400, 600. That's up to you. And how you approach this is uh, you can do a corner of your backyard, as you see here on the left, or you can choose to work on your curb appeal. Again, it is all up to you as to how you proceed with this program. Um, you know, just real quick design tips. In your backyard, you can always, what I always tell people, aim for the fences in terms of where you may choose to um, uh, add a landscape bed. Um, it's always very easy to work along the fence lines. This is a simple one in the, uh, in the corner. Or like I said, in your uh, work on your curbside appeal. Um, again, up to you. All right. So the other before part- we go, Before we go on oh, that, yes. I just wanted to uh, tell everyone that we highly encourage the use of hard edging like this. Uh, this is called chop block uh, on the, the photo on the left. Um, it just helps you separate the two between the lawn and the bed because there are different management techniques and watering that you need to do between the two. You're going to apply compost and mulch in one and only compost or fertilization on the other. You may have to water the grass a little bit more and the beds you don't have to water hardly at all. So uh, the use of a hard edging is highly encouraged. Just wanted to say that. No, that's great, thank you. All right, so speaking of watering hardly at all, really not at all, is our patio scape coupon. So again, 200 square feet per coupon, but with this coupon, you can transform uh, parts of your yard into either a flat stone patio or a 12 by 12 paver. It's up to you. So the coupon itself covers stepping stones, pavers, and flat stone. And the same idea is that you're removing 200 square feet at a time or 400 or up to you. Before you, you see two great examples that our customers uh, finished last year. One of them just happened to increase the size of their patio, as you can see, uh, with a nice pool on the side. Another person just decided to add on to, I think what they already had started and simply finished out a nice patio, an outdoor living space that goes very, very well in the shade, I think. Um, the average cost for the patio scape has been about $325. So with a $100 coupon, it's, it, it's, it's a substantial amount, but it, it does offer you a discount on something that normally is not discounted. Okay, so that's a great deal. Now, you, as I mentioned earlier, those with irrigation get $200. And the reason for that is because if folks, our customers with irrigation systems, uh, we have found tend to use more water than those without. So we really want to encourage any kind of permanent solutions to uh, watering parts of your landscape. So there isn't anything better than a patio scape feature. Hence, to encourage our customers with irrigation to do that, we offer $200. It's a great deal. Okay. All right, here is an example of what one customer did in the front yard, combine both. And this is something that we do encourage you get creative. You know, uh, you can combine them. Uh, for example, this person over here on the left could have added their choice, a landscape bed next along the edging, just to, you know, highlight that. That's a choice, but that's another way you could have combined it just like this customer did. So, Again, in this, in this example, there was uh, saws in a way contributed $300, two patio escape coupons and one landscape coupon, $300. It's a great deal to, to help with uh, the overall cost of such a project. Now, because this was done in the front of the house, just the, something that I wanna warn our customers about, many of you live in um, HOAs and all HOAs, um, have certain rules as to what you can or cannot do in your front yard. Uh, perhaps they won't allow a flat stone uh, feature such as this in their in uh, in their neighborhood. So always check with your HOA as to to make sure as to what you can and cannot do. The last thing you want is to be asked to remove something that you work so hard and put it in. Okay, and it's I I most HOAs are easy to deal with. So don't don't let that stop you. Okay, just be prepared and have a, an easy rendering of what you propose to do 
they would appreciate it and you will it'll make it easier in the long run okay all right as i said we do want to encourage our customers with irrigation to uh reduce the amount of it um that's why we offer a free irrigation consultation to those customers i think it is for customers that have an irrigation system this is the best program you can tap into simply because if nothing else, we will help you with the programming, better aim the water that you will use in your landscape better, uh, and it's free. So uh, right now we are scheduling consultations. Uh, if you can get in sooner than later is better, because as we get into the summer, there'll be more of demand for this. Uh, when we go to your home, not only will we give you some good uh, recommendations in terms of programming, we will also calculate the gallons per minute per zone in order to use that to calculate the rebate that you could tap into if the changes you make using our landscape coupons or patio scape coupon adds up to a certain amount, basically per zones, okay? And that could be from a few hundred dollars to thousands. To give us a little bit more details as to what that covers, uh, Mark's gonna go through it. And I know this is small, but again, this is on our website, okay? All right, Mark. And first of all, Juan, where can every anyone go to schedule their consultation? They can call 704 save. Whoa. Save. 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 <laughs> Thank you. 210 seven. So, uh, and previously we had some uh you could sign up by a computer. Um no, no, we're no longer doing that. We're trying to target everything. And uh, please call 704 save all right and as Juan said uh it's a little small you can find this on our website again that website is garden style san antonio or garden style sa.com and you go to the programs and look this up uh we have several different it is a cafeteria style so that means you can select and match but the application is the consultation so once you have the consultation, you may go forward and, and conduct, uh, uh, your, conduct these activities and work on your, your irrigation system. Of course, we love to have complete removal, what we call retirement of the system. Uh, that's going to save the most amount of water. Uh, then you have other choices here, what we call targeted changes, and those would be uh, capping uh, a zone and and all of our programs all our rebates are based on removing zones we don't have programs where you count heads now this is per zone and so you'll have to remove the valve uh, and as many visible heads as you can but the valve is the most important and then we also have uh, a pressure reducing head for either grass or landscapes uh, conversion to drip or finally an installation of a master valve and you may wonder what what is a master valve a master valve is a, a valve which senses big leaks and it shuts down the entire system so you don't have those leaks going on uh, over the weekend or for weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks so it shuts down the system so those are all based on again the consultation and the number of zones and the GPM that is calculated, and your consult will tell you, your consultant will tell you during the consult what those are, and then offer you a a, uh, a rebate based on those. So, if you go to the next slide, please. Yeah, the consultation remember serves as the application really, and right. so that's why you need to do it in order to proceed with irrigation with the irrigation rebate if you choose to tap into it. All right, Mark, what can you tell us about our our smart irrigation control? Oh, our smart irrigation um, program. Uh, uh, we, we, we did this slowly over the past year, year and a half. A smart irrigator, a smart uh, controller uh, looks at the weather, analyzes the weather, and then recommends watering based on that. However, in San Antonio, they must, uh, smart controllers must also abide by the watering stage regulations. And what are we in right now? That's right, stage one right now. Uh, so it would have to abide by that. 
but they are very nouveau, very cutting edge technology. What do you have to have? Well, you have to be a customer of good standing to be able to get one. Uh, all your bills have to be paid. Uh, you have to have Wi-Fi. You have to have a smartphone because it's going to work with those and and tell the one the Wi-Fi will connect with the uh, local weather station and, and tell the uh, controller back on, on what to water. So uh, right now there is only one simple uh, controller and that's ratio or ratio. Well, no one really knows how to spell or pronounce the name. Ratio, uh, and uh, you can go online and uh, purchase one. The rebate will be $150. I'm sorry, $100. We have another program that's $150. $100, and we will and we will get uh, a notification of when it's installed, and then uh, you apply for the rebate, and then we send it to you. But you purchase Mark, Mark, yeah. this is actually a coupon. So you're going to apply for oh. this and you get a hundred dollars off of the purchase price okay. of the controller. Thank you, because uh, uh, I am not as familiar with this particular as with others. And our lovely Sarah is called, is a little under the weather today. So uh, thank you, Martha. I appreciate that. So that's coupon and then applies that to the purchase price. Correct. Right. Yeah. All right. Let's uh, let's uh, zoom forward. Uh, so I'm more familiar with. What I like to tell our customers about the difference between coupons and rebates is basically that coupons are something for what you're about to do, go shopping, uh, versus the rebate, which is for what you have done, as an easy way to separate them. Because sometimes we use those words interchangeably. <laughs> But there is a difference. There is yeah, a difference. in other parts of the country, uh, they're strictly rebates, and uh, we like coupons as well because it offers a much more uh, a greater opportunity, greater pool of, of people to come in and yeah. uh, promote their products. And it's a certain amount of ease of access to the programs themselves too. I think uh, because some things lend themselves to coupons, others to rebates. So it's That's nice to have a combination of both. I was going to say, again, thank you, Martha. Yes, of course. Get some more coffee. <laughs> All right. So rewards. So this program um, launched a few years ago and has really taken off. And I think it's just going to keep growing uh, because there's a lot of flexibility to this program. And basically, it, we reward you for learning and for doing. Learning by attending workshops, presentations, that uh, are marked to are have been deemed worthy of earning points for attending. Other ways to uh, earn points is by completing successfully submitting your inspection photos, for, like for the landscape and patio scape coupon, for example, or the irrigation rebate as well. You get points for that as well. Points add up quickly. As you can see, we have a thirty dollar coupon a $50 coupon and a $70 coupon. These are sent to you automatically as you accumulate the points. So if you hit the three point threshold, for example, you automatically get sent the $30 coupon. Add two more points and you automatically get sent a $50 coupon. Add two more points and you get sent a $70 coupon. So if you manage to get all your points in a short period of time, you get all three in a short period of time. We just ask that you be patient as we process these, all the points that, all the workshops that are being done. And there's a lot going on this month as we kick off spring. So what can you do with these coupons? Well, for the, with a $30 coupon, it is used for you to purchase tools or a rain barrel. Okay, tools you can use to buy, say, a tamper. Say you are in the middle of creating a patio scape, uh, a patio scape using our coupon, but you want to make sure where it's proper installation, as you see here in the picture, you may want to tamp that down so that you have it even or sloping as you want it to slope away from your house, for example. You can, but you need to tamp it down. So you, if you don't have one, you could use the coupon, for example, to purchase that particular tool. Or you can uh, choose to purchase a, a rain barrel. 
uh, rain barrels can be purchased at Soda Soda Depot. They retail for about $90. So the $30 offers you a discount on that. Okay. So you, uh, but if you've done the, your three points, you add two more points and you get the $50 coupon. That coupon can be used to purchase mulch. So again, look at the picture on the left. If you have done your landscape coupon, you're going to want mulch in order to finish that project out. That's a great thing because it helps with uh, uh, moisture retention. So you, $50 of mulch is a lot of mulch. It'll go a long way to finishing out your project. Or you can also use it to purchase uh, uh, compost, which you can use um, in a variety of ways as well. Uh, two more points for $70. This is where it really opens up a lot. $70 coupon, really, there's very few things that you can't buy. And that is either pesticides or insecticides or fertilizers, that kind of thing. Other than that, you can purchase anything. If, for example, you were to combine it with a $30 coupon, that's $100 total, you can purchase a rain barrel. And basically, it's free to you because it's $90. Plus, um, or you can use it to buy uh, the edging, for example. As you can see in the picture on the left, you can buy the edger to really finish out your landscape product and have it look really, really nice. Or you can simply choose to buy a bird bath and put it right in the middle of your new landscape bed. That is up to you, okay? So again, think about how you can combine them with each. You don't have to use them with the landscape or patio scape coupon. You can use them just on their own, but get creative. See, how can I maximize what I'm gonna do in my yard? especially if you have a large area that you're working on, especially if you're new to gardening and you're still, you know, assembling all the tools that you would uh, need, um, not just today, not just for this project, but in the long run, okay? The great thing about rewards is that next year, you start at zero points and you can start accumulating more points and earning more coupons per year. So it's a great deal. It is that to me, it's the one program that can help you enhance your project. All right. Uh, and just to remind everyone, I just, everyone, no, I just, just remind everyone. everyone that you can get uh, four points total from the webinars. But if you go to the website, gardenstyle, uh, San Antonio dot com forward slash spring hyphen bloom, you can see all our other programs that you can do today this week during spring bloom. We, we have scavenger hunts. We have opportunities to go to the botanical gardens and look at our water saver lane and read some of the uh, topics there, and then uh, take a little survey. So uh, you can get up to six points out of that seven just this week. So I wanna point that out and hopefully everyone will, will, uh, will do those and uh, participate that and get their six out of the seven points this week. And Let's if you fill can, out a survey though. Exactly. And if you can get all those points this week for spring bloom, the, you'll see a snapshot of our calendar and I highlighted all the pro workshops that are uh, rewards eligible. In a short amount of time, you can accumulate seven points really quickly. And you combine that with your application for landscape and patio scape ahead of time. Again, start thinking about how you can do that. I did want to say that our landscape and patio scape coupon, the application is live. That is a seasonal program and we accept applications through, we are accepting through October 15th. And you'll have until November 15th to use. That's when those coupons expire. The thing about rewards is that they have a 90 day life, okay? So once you get them, you have 90 days to use. Don't let them expire. Make sure you have a reason, something in mind as to what you can use those coupons for, okay? So make sure that you manage your time as well in terms of how you're gonna utilize those coupons. All right. So just a quick reminder, you know, we're talking about hundreds of, of dollars for the landscape and patio scape coupons that you can tap into. If you have an irrigation system, a few hundred, depending on how big your changes are, and they must amount to whole zones being removed, you can get hundreds, possibly thousands, especially if you remove your entire irrigation system. Um, but that's another discussion right there. Uh, but that easily goes up into the thousands. And then, of course, rewards. 
Rewards is the one that, it, again, enhances everything that you can do. All right. So we have one more program for you. And before I pass it on to Mark, uh, this will be the last program that we will discuss, and then we will take your questions. And I'm sure we will have plenty. All right, Mark. Yes. Uh, we want to talk about flow sensors. We've been uh, have this uh, rebate for uh, close to two years now, and we received testimonial after testimonial after testimonial about about how these flow sensors have saved their water bill, uh, particularly during the historic freeze a few weeks ago. So uh, we highly encourage everyone to at least look into the flow sensors. So we have this web page uh, on our rebate page. So I encourage everybody to go to go there. Uh, there's a couple of things you need to do. Uh, research the eligible products. And right now we have three eligible products. Uh, determine the costs on each one of those. And this is the important part. The products, important part, the products uh, do different things. There's only one that will measure both indoor and outdoor water usage. There's only one that is uh, self-installed. The other two require plumbers. So look at those and we say the flume is the one that leads in both those categories. They have, it is self-installed and it measures both outdoor and indoor water usage. So go to the website uh, and uh, uh, it is a rebate. So you purchase this one you purchase, and then uh, when we are informed as when, as to when it is installed by the food company, and at that point, uh, if you have applied, then we'll no be notified as to send the check. So you have to apply for it, a purchase, apply, and then we'll send the check. However, we have a brief note on the bottom there. Uh, we'll be looking at a new program. SAWS, uh, as a company, will be looking at a new program, and it's called Connect H2O. Uh, unfortunately, the flume does not work uh, or is not compatible with the uh, Connect H2O program. So uh, if you do have those program, uh, you will be informed of whether or not you'll be a part of that program. Uh, but unfortunately, you will not be able to use the flume. I highly encourage everyone to look into the flow sensor. It helps with both leak detection and water management. There you go. One. There we go. Uh, just a final uh, couple of statements. Uh, remember to become a rewards member today. Uh, well, that's actually, I wrote this uh, for the, the last program. <laughs> so become a rewards member by Saturday midnight, please. Now, if you order in order to be eligible for the points and the prizes, I haven't touched on the prizes. I was waiting towards the end here. Uh, you must be a rewards member. To be eligible for the points, you go to gardenstylesanantonio.com spring bloom. The prizes which we were going to be, which we are going to draw uh, daily and at the end, uh, you must be a rewards member and, and filled out a survey. Uh, these prizes will be $25 coupons and they can be used for anything except pesticides and fungus and, and fertilizers. So make sure that uh, you get your points, but also you can be eligible for a prize. And that will be a $25 coupon. Now, uh, Martha, I believe we've been collecting some questions, Q&A. Uh, what yeah. are those questions? Yeah, so as, as um, you guys are listening to some of the questions, go ahead and ask more of them um, in the Q&A box. Um, we're going to try to get to as many as we can. Um, but if we don't get your question answered, or if it's a more specific question, we may not get to it. You can always go check out gardenstylesa.com. You can ask the garden gate questions on there. Um, but for now, one thing we wanted to point out was that 
um, someone gave us a very great hint that we should we should mention this pretty clearly. The rewards coupons, the patio scape coupons, and the landscape coupons all kind of function the same. They're all good at participating vendors. Juan, I know mentioned the the um, patio scape and landscape are good at participating vendors. The rewards coupons, I believe, Juan, correct me if I'm wrong. I believe they're they're all good at the same places. That is correct. So okay. just really quick, not to give a shout out to anyone in particular, but for example, you, your favorite local nurseries are mm -hmm. many of them are yeah. on accept our coupon as well and, as the patty scape. Yeah, and then somebody asked um, that asked about combining the coupons, and Juan, you gave the example of like the bird bath, the rain barrel. Yes, if you get the thirty dollar. Um, or if you get the one, can you get, sorry, yeah, can you give an example okay. of how that's been doing a long time. Okay, say you've gone to the nursery and you've had your eyes on this beautiful bird bath that retails for $100 and you got yourself a $30, um, a $70 coupon, but you can use that. Now, let's go back to the rain barrel example that I gave. If you add the $30 coupon, which you can use for a rain barrel and the 70, that's $100, okay? Now a tool, now the example of that, say, uh, God, what's an expensive, one of those nice uh, loppers or one of those uh, saws, you know, to really- Yeah, get triangle key, you screen yourself, yes. Yeah, those are expensive, but you can use, you can buy both of those to defray the cost of such a tool, which could be, I guess, in the hundreds, right, Mark? Yes. So that's a great discount. Yes, so yes, Perfect. you can combine that way. Thank you. Sorry, I couldn't come up with a good example real quick. No, you're, you're doing um, right. So just to answer a couple of people's quick questions, if you signed up for the rewards program in the past, you should mm -hmm. still be eligible. Um, so if you signed up for it last year, you're kind of carried over year to year. Yes. Um, and you should be getting our rewards emails every so often about kind of upcoming programs. Um, so if you have a question, somebody else asked, if, how to verify that they're still a rewards member or that they signed up in the first place, you can always give us a call at 210-704-SAVE and talk to one of our conservation team members to get some um, to get them to check that you are a rewards member. Um, okay, one for you, the total of eight coupons per lifetime is attached to the address, not the customer, correct? That is correct. So say you live at 123 Main Street, um, and then you did all your eight coupons four years ago and you move across the street to three, four, five Main Street. You can reapply again. It's per account. And then um, where do they find out how many coupons they have already used? I guess I would say if you call us at 704 save, we can get you that information. Yeah. Right, Mark? And a, you can always apply actually and see how, how, how far you can get. <laughs> um, does the grass that we would be removing have to be formal or commercial grass? When we moved in our grass, grass in quotes, is majority yes. weeds. Yeah, no, that's fine. You can, that will qualify as well. The other way that you can think of this program is to avoid grass, especially for new, new uh, homeowners, because sometimes you get, you know, the sod in the front and not in the back. And the temptation may be to put in more sod in the back. So rather than do that, we would rather have you get creative and create the landscape beds or a patio. So you can tap into the into the coupon program to do that. Um, and can coupons one be used towards a vegetable garden? No. Okay. No. The the per, the the landscape coupon, there is a set of very specific um, plants, but within those plants, there's a lot of variety. The one that always comes to mind is the salvia, for example. You know, there's just not one salvia. There's not just one color of bloom. There's a variety, even for sun versus shade. Some that'll do better in those conditions. Uh, but the the plants, there's well over a hundred that you can pick from that will do very well in San Antonio. Um, yeah, we're not gonna talk about trees today. <laughs> <laughs> so if, I, if we do not have an irrigation, if we do not have an irrigation system, can we get a consultation regarding drip irrigation? No, it's no. For, for our customers that have an automatic, installed automatic irrigation system. 
Yeah. And you know, just more this morning, I got an email from a customer who's looking to get an irrigation, put in an irrigation system, and was asking what's available to them because they also want to do landscape and pediscape coupon. So I had to let them know that no, we would actually encourage you not to get one. And this is the reason why, uh, mm -hmm. because they use so much more water and they don't target the water as as much as you think it does. Um, so uh, no. And then again, for those who um, are wanting to confirm that you're registered for rewards or that um, how many coupons have I done in the past or whatever, the phone number is 210-704-SAVE, which is 7283. So 704-7283, just to, just to get that really clear on there. Um, if public schools are converting grass to native beds, can they earn coupons or money to put towards projects? Those coupons, that, pro that program is strictly for, resi for residents right now. Uh, not for commercial purposes. But really, they could, if they did rewards, they could buy some plants uh, or whatever with those re with that seventy dollar rewards coupon, or take the mulch and and use it towards it, right? Well, right. as we know, a lot of teachers use their own personal funds to pay things. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. If a teacher or parent would like to use their coupon and donate materials to the school, we would hardly purchase that. So the seventy dollar could be used to buy good native plants, for example, and you can donate them. I guess, yeah. All right. Um, someone mentioned, which I verified with Sasha real quick while we were on here, the water saver lane. Um, the uh, water saver lane. Lane. It's kind of an outdoor it's scavenger a, hunt. Right, and it's worth two points. It is on the website that it is worth two points. So um, yes, even though I uh, uh, with an educational system, uh, I realized during the part of this program that we had changed the water saver lane to two points, and you could get a point for each one of the programs today, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. That's four. And you can do the scavenger hunt, and that's one. And you could do the water saver lane, and that's two. That would add up to what? Seven points. So we had made some changes over the over the months of planning. So you um, can get uh, seven points. Where is the survey located? You're going to want to go back to the Spring Bloom website, and you're going to find all of the upcoming programs that Mark talked about at the beginning, all the upcoming webinars, as well as all of the survey links, as well as the um, the Water Saver Lane stuff. The yes, uh, yeah, hunt. All, all the prizes and, and the scavenger hunt and the Water Saver Lane. And that's going to be at SAWS. The shortest way to find that is SAWS.org slash Spring Bloom. That's the easiest way to find it. Yeah, or you can go to directly through Garden Style San Antonio.com forward slash Spring hyphen Bloom. Um, one for you. I don't have grass in my backyard at all. Only dirt. Can I still apply for the patio and landscape coupons? Yes. So help you avoid putting in grass, which I think is sometimes considered by a lot of people an easy uh, uh, solution. But in the long run, it's going to be the most water demanding part of your landscape. So why we'd rather have you avoid that and install something else. And what about can you install a deck with it? No, we cannot. It's very the the patio scape is very specific. Blackstone, stepping stones, and pavers. Uh, it, yeah, not. The, the, uh, and people have asked that. Uh, we would like to see that, but there's some uh, some legalities versus a contract versus a coupon. The reason why we have done it that way, we would like to see it, uh, but as it stands right now, no. Yeah. And then Mark, is the flume still worth getting since it's not compatible with the new H2O Connect program? That program, the H2 Connect is a, do we say pilot? It's an ongoing program, but very small. I would encourage everybody to get the flume. Uh, maybe down the road, it wouldn't be compatible for the majority of SAUS customers. Right now, I would say it's still compatible and I think it's just well worth it particularly with our rebate. 
Yeah, as long as you haven't been notified that you're in that H2O Connect program, specifically notified of that, you would have gotten a postcard and or an email from us. Um, if you've gotten that, then no, it's not worth it. But for others, I, I agree with Mark. I think it's really worth it. Um, let's see. Do you um, have to pay for admission to the botanical gardens to stroll down Water Saver Lane this week? Yes. And that's why it's worth two points rather than just one. That's why we made the change. Right. It's more points because you do have to pay for it. Now, Botanical Garden is gorgeous and wonderful and lots of water conservation ideas and plants. Um, but having said that, yeah, that's why it's two points. All right, and we have a couple more questions to get through. Um, I have already removed grass and placed mulch. Can I still get a coupon for the plants? I have not planted the plants yet. Okay, so I'm going to say yes because you have done the prep work, so to speak, but you must use the coup the plants that you purchased with our coupons. You need to make sure that it's 200 square feet at least. So yes, you can. And for those who are saying that they haven't signed up for rewards yet, is it too late to do that and get points for the classes today or this week? No, just sign up for it. And it's it's not a long sign up process, I promise. So go check yeah. out gardenstylesa.com after this um, and sign up for rewards. Get the link for the survey to take the quiz for today. And that way then you'll get all your points. And, and we have and a lot of people who are going to be attending these classes over the next few days. So give us a few days to get your coupons to you if you are earning them this week. And it's really easy. Uh, your rewards number is your cell phone number. Yeah, we try to keep it simple. Just repeat, once you're a rewards member, you're always a rewards member. Your points turn over each year, but you will always be a rewards member. You don't have to sign up every year. Correct. Um, does the square footage of grass removal have to be all in one area or can it be split amongst areas? So you can split, for example, if you request four coupons, you can split them by 200 square feet. You can put them on either corner of your lot, for example, two in the back, two in the front, but you cannot separate within the 200. And we'll you cannot do 50, 50, 50. That's, that's, that's a no, no. No, no, no. Um, just, I do want to say, I, I mentioned some uh, our, a little bit about our video library. In there, there's a video about how to measure 200 square feet. I know a lot of people sometimes have uh, issues with that. And there's a, they got me, um, <laughs> uh, video <laughs> you know, on how you can do that. And actually using a rope and how you can tie 60 feet together and then flex it around to get really creative. So make sure to check that out as well. But uh, anyway, hope that answers your question. And I'll yeah. say also something 200 square feet to me sounds like a lot, but it's yeah. the size of roughly the size of a parking space. A so, parking space, a large truck. Right. Yeah. So it's not as big as you may think it is. Yeah. Um, we have a really good question. What is the benefit of removing a grassy area that may be providing recharge through infiltration of flood control in order to install an impervious surface? In the form of a patio scape. Well, we've been uh, indirectly mentioning it over uh, during this entire program, so we need to really say it. Uh, grass uses the most water, and so we want to remove that aspect of the landscape and replace it with something that doesn't use any water, a pervious hardscape or uh, plants which uh, provide lots of pollination to the butterflies, bees, and birds. Uh, as far as talking about infiltration, uh, you can get the same infiltration with uh, uh, bedding plants, wild and native plants, uh, a, a type of hardscape. Uh, you can even put in there and get good infiltration. So uh, grass is not the only thing uh, that we can put in, in that. Now, grass is very simple because that is a regulatory. Uh, the state and federal government often uses grass. It is not the most creative way to do it. Okay, so we're going to rapid just, fire. Oh, really quick, really, really quick. Mm -hmm. We're only able to get to so many of the requirements that are associated with our programs today. But again, go to our website, review the requirements per program. 
okay? Just to make sure that the, that you are doing it correctly and not harming the environment, for example. So, so we're gonna rapid fire through maybe five more questions. One thing I just wanna clarify because we did answer it a little bit ago, vegetable gardens are not gonna qualify for the, um, the uh, landscape coupon. So um, we've gotten that several times yeah. The answer is no, sorry. Um, the, for Again, the link to the survey is going to be on the gardenstylesa.com, the spring bloom page. The easiest way to get there is saws.org slash spring bloom, and it'll take you right to it. Um, is Mark, I'm going to yes. kind of assign these questions to you guys. Real quick answers. Okay. Mark, is there a time limit to doing the survey after doing these activities? Like today's webinar how long do they have to do the survey uh when you go to the site you'll be able to see if it's uh, activated or not uh sasha will turn on the surveys and for a lim limited amount of time uh generally that day right. but, so so take it right away after this don't yeah. don't wait until don't Saturday dilly dally around today. um one my irrigation system is really old and not automatic do i still qualify for the removal rebate by not automatic, no controller. That's what I'm assuming. And did not specify. Uh, uh, if it's not functional one. Yeah. Um, we call may, us. Yeah, we may be interested. We need to, there's more things to consider. So I would say call and we 704 7283. Give us a call. Yeah. Yeah. Um, there may be different rebates for a functional versus non functional. That's the thing. Mark, can you do larger than 200 square feet with a single coupon? Yes. You know, they do more. That is the minimum. Well, it's like say, uh, a lot of people like to do just the minimum. Uh, other people like to do a lot more than just the minimum, but that's the minimum. That's the, the, the bar. And if you're getting close to 400 square feet, we'd obviously encourage you to, to go to that 400 other. square feet and do two and coupons. And over the years, Juan and I have been very generous. Yeah. And so and if you are so, 380. So, sorry, we're sorry running for. close on time. Juan, um, if, an area that's 25 feet long by six feet wide, would that qualify for patio scape? You're at 150 square feet. Can you find 50 more? And you got yourself 200 square feet. Okay, and then um, last question. This should be an easy one. My irrigation system was not working when I moved in. Any rebates to remove it? Yes. Yes. Give us a call. Schedule the first step in in um, any of the rebates. The uh, irrigation rebates is going to be giving us a call to schedule a, a irrigation consultation. You can let us know at that time that the system's non-functional um, or not working. And we will send out one of our fantastic consultants um, from our team, and they will tell you how much that rebate is and all the details. So with that, Mark um, covered at the very beginning of all of this, what the upcoming spring bloom events are, I would encourage you one more time, go back to saws.org slash spring bloom to see all the details of upcoming upcoming webinars and events this week um, and we're glad you guys joined us for the first day of spring bloom <coughs> at, first day, at, first day first day we hope to see you guys at upcoming events thank you again for joining us thank you everyone thank you thank you everyone thank you martha